Hey, what up y'all? It's me, your boy, Lil D, coming at you from the den with another nursing video. And in today's video, we're gonna be reviewing this gloves in a bottle. Now, before we get into the video, go ahead and give this video a like and subscribe. I post nursing related videos one to two times a week. So if you haven't subscribed already, go ahead and do that. If you have any video ideas, go ahead and leave them in the comments down below. I'm constantly jotting down my own ideas, but if there's something you wanna see me do, then I'll definitely make a video about it if it's nursing related. So this product could not have come at a better time. So gloves in a bottle, they're on Instagram, gloves in a bottle USA, I'll tag it right here. Gloves in a bottle, you're probably wondering what that means. So with everything going around, we're all washing our hands so much, especially in the hospital, going room to room, we're sanitizing, washing, sanitizing, washing, your hands start to get really, really dry. Now gloves in a bottle, it's more of a lotion, protective cream that you put on your hands to help protect your hands from cracking, from drying out. And this is something that I experienced in the hospital because I am washing my hands so much. Where the Purell in the hospital is much more soft than that Purell outside, which is nicer because we made that switch a while ago, it still starts to dry up your hands. This lotion is cruelty free, which is pretty awesome. And when you put it on, it's not really thick. You know, the barrier cream, I like to think of the barrier cream we put on patients and how thick that gets and how it becomes so pasty. And actually that barrier cream, if you put it on the back of your hands, it works pretty well too. But this does not leave that thick residue on and all you need is a dime size. Now I believe they sell this product on their website and, I'm on, and on Amazon. So if you're interested in a protective shielding lotion, then you can check out the link below. But yeah, that is it for this review. Not too much to it. Oh, last thing, it does not really have, it doesn't really have a fragrance. So that's good if you're working in the hospital with patients who are sensitive to smells, especially perfumes, body washes, even shampoos sometimes people are very sensitive to. So it doesn't have any scent to it. Go ahead and check out one of my other nursing related videos right here. Give this video a like and subscribe for more YouTube videos and I'll talk to you guys later. Thanks. Bye.